play a vital role in the development of new shipping. China will have a huge influence in the future direction of world shipping. Trade patterns will change uh, and there will be new ports and new areas trading that we don't see today. Seaborne trade in 2030 will be driven by population growth, increased wealth and demand for more commodities. Global Marine Trends 2030 sets out a number of scenarios for the future uh, which may or may not come true, but they're based on objective evidence for the, uh, the, the growth of naval, commercial and offshore energy uh, trends over the next 20 years. It was produced by Lloyd's Register, Kinetic and the University of Strathclyde as an informal consortium with common aims. It's the first time that ever anybody has brought together naval, commercial and offshore energy fields in a way that predicts that future or uh, uh, suggests that future um, and therefore we think it's a first for our customers and we hope that they will make as much use of it for their strategic planning as we will. So, uh, however, provide about six possible disruptions which cause the scenario to completely change the path to a totally different, different, uh, different world. In 2030, we will see a, see a world of uh, no single power dominate. Uh, whether it's commercial, whether it's naval, whether it's an offshore uh, exploration, uh, we see a world very complicated. The economy obviously set the scenes for uh, the activity, human activities around the world. Um, China will become, will take over USA, becomes the largest oil consumer. By 2030, we expect that the energy demand will increase by about 40%. Of that amount, 60% will be met by oil and gas supplies. And of course, uh, uh, oil and gas will be produced either from land-based uh, uh, resources or ocean, deep ocean resources. And we expect that 50% of this uh, uh, supply will come from deep ocean uh, resources. We feel it's really important that the different stakeholders in the industry act, act together we all understand the future that we face and we can all work together to, to uh, come up with some, some sensible, workable, safe, clean solutions. 2030, it sounds like a long way off, but if you're joining the industry now, that's only going to be halfway through your working career. So starting to think about it is essential. So we are going to be faced with a different world, let's plan for a different world, let's think about the different world and let's use a document like this to initiate debate and make sure that we're well placed for the future. Yeah.